Hello again everyone, thank you for joining me, I hope you're all well. Okay, so there's going to be a spoiler in a second, so if you don't want to see it, look away now and cover your ears. Okay, so behind the sawmill are some more files, so we'll grab them. And uh, right, so at the end of the last one, I am really sorry about how it worked out time-wise. Um, it told us to uh, go and search this car, so someone's been kidnapped. And uh, yeah, so let's have a quick look round. Right, three pedals, manual gearbox. Okay, so that's not too suspicious. Uh, no headrests. It's quite an old car. Okay. Wheels all look round. There's another one in there. For, um, I suppose going sideways. Um, number plate looks alright. There's an engine there. Reverse light. Fog light. Bit of rust. What am I looking for, mate? What am I looking for? <laughs> um, does it mean search nearby the car? Is that what it means? Uh... hell am I meant to be doing? Oh, what's that? Ah, wallet. Hmm, can't we just empty it? No. I wouldn't do that in real life, by the way. Is it you that we speak to? Dimitri Dimitri. He must have gotten himself in something again. He's been working here for a year. He often sticks his nose into other people's business, I think that's it. Talk to Kozlov. Is that him over there, mate? Nope. What are you eating? Oh, you're smoking. Okay. Who are you? Dumb I. Hello, mate. Who are you? Nice. It came out really stupid. I thought I would find something of value here. There. Working in a sawmill gives is no walk in the park, and I have a family to support. All I found was this notebook. Please take it and let's forget the whole thing. I'm getting closer to the truth. I have to check other leads. Talk to your tool dealer. Search the warehouse at the Drunken Bear Inn. Ask the sawmill workers. Explore the ruins in the vicinity of the quarry. Oh my goodness. Right. Cheers, mate. Hello. Can we have a piggyback? Right. Yes, I always used to find wallets when I worked in that petrol station. And, um... I wouldn't take any money out. I'd go through, see if I could find a driver's license or some kind of ID. And then, uh, yeah, like return it to them. And people were so surprised that you hadn't stolen money out of it. But, uh, yeah, a few times people did actually count it. And I find that really disrespectful. Because if I lost my wallet, um, I wouldn't be checking how much money in there was in there. I'd be... Um, yeah, getting some out to give to the person. Which happened a few times. I did used to get that kind of karma happen. But I didn't do it for the cash. I just did it because imagine how awful it would be losing your wallet. Right. Uh, keep going. 
who would buy a brown car? So in my area, there's about 50,000 um, dishwater brown Fiat 500s. And I think they look absolutely disgusting. I really do. But um, obviously lots of people don't think that because um, lots of people have bought them. If I was going to get a company car and I didn't like the company, I'd probably choose a horrific colour just to spite them. But, um, yeah. Right, so do we go down here then? Yeah. Oh, no. Hold on, lads. I take it we were meant to be killing these people. I think that's... Yeah. It's alright. Man down. Right, we're going to run out of bullets. But it's quite quick. Oh, it's quite convenient. Grenade! Right. Anyone else? I should be trying to get some bullets back, shouldn't I? Oh, we've bought all the bloody cigarettes. Do you want a cigarette? Smoke this. Oh. Oh. Right. Hello, mate. Right, six bullets left. It appears you can't do that. Oh, no. Hold on. Hold on. Uh, we're done for, really, aren't we? Oh, no, we're dying. Ah, oh, I think I've got one more of them. Oh. Okay, yep. Yeah. Luckily, last checkpoint. Right, shall we try a little bit harder this time? So, let's uh, get the gun out. And, um... Hmm, has that given us some more bullets? I don't know. So can we do this stealthily? Well, no, because it's me, isn't it? No, don't launch a grenade. Oh, we don't need shotgun ammo. Oh. Please, pistol. Oh. had a crash oh big crash right let's lead them out here I can use this that just shot the back of the truck didn't it oh right you've got a pistol so does that mean you've got some ammo nice two nope no grenades please Right, I'm going to do it this time. Oh. <laughs> oh. It does work. Were you in the toilet? Oh. Who happens? Hello, mate. Gents. Right, so three, three shots to the face and he's still not down. Six bullets left. Great. Right, just stand still for a moment, please. Oh. 
Right, so he's probably got bullets on him. Go, go, go. No, no grenades. Right. Any KGB? No. Sitting down on the job, aren't I? Right, is that everyone now? Oh, we don't need it. Right, we've already searched him. Bugger off. Right. Come on now, Jolly. You can do this. I've got faith in you. No one else has. Oh, getting your leg over. Right, we haven't got a rifle. Ah. Right, let's close that just in case there's any more. What's this? Nice. Right, Sergey, we discovered one of ours is a double agent. You say that again. Thanks to him, Ivan was sent to a labour camp yesterday. Be vigilant. The police are on our trail. Boris. Kiss, kiss, kiss. Right, okay. So, I don't think we can actually pick it up, no. So, what else have we got in there? Anything good? Vodka. Oh, we got to run. Go. Uh, oh, I haven't got time to search it. Right, where's the truck? Over there. So we've got bugger all bullets again, which is uh, not great, is it? This is all battered up. Right, map. So we're going that away. Perfect. Oh, I could have brought the prisoners along. Okay. Labour camp. Great. Hello, uh, mate. Ah, was prabotne je to Ivan. Heno matko trzasta je. Oh, terrible. Probably put the gun away, shouldn't I? He's the bald guy with the red beard. I doubt he wants to talk to you in good faith. Okay, we'll see about that. Right, so question a prisoner. So can I go? Yep. Right, bald guy, red beard, we're looking. It's not red, was it? Oh, hold on, mate. What does he do? Uh, yeah, it's not him. Uh, not him. I didn't realise you could actually come down here. I, or maybe it's just because of this uh, mission. Right, so he's not down there. And I don't think there's anyone in here, is there? No. Nope. I wonder if there's files in there. Probably. Right. You're not bald. Anyone down here? Yep. Yeah. Right, I'll leave the gate open. Plenty of armed guards around. Right, he's not bald. Hmm. Ah. It's not really red though, is it? Right. Your people kidnapped our agent. Tell me where they might have taken him. Okay. Right. 
About now. Is this actually working? Oh. Right, what do I need to do then? Uh, what do I do? Make him talk. Uh, I'm not giving him anything. Um, shoot him in the foot. Oh, come on, game. Oh. So, I, I don't know how to punch. Um, I blind him. Um. Is there anything laying about that I can do anything with? What about if I speak to this bloke? Nope. Oh. Don't see that crane. Not by the looks of it. Nope. Put a cone on him. What am I meant to do? Get him to shoot him. Right, let's go and stab him up. Oh, here we go. Right, cemetery. Right, cheers, mate. It's probably quite an infuriating... Uh, episode to watch. Sorry about that. Right. That's, uh, yeah, if I got shot in the foot, I'd probably, uh, probably be more likely to talk. Right. Okay. Oh. Okay. It's alright. It's not like we're in a rush. Good old WASD driving as well. <clears throat> and I'm losing my voice. Great. Okay, so the cemetery I don't think is that far away. Alright, other side of the map, ignore me. Do you know what? I'm going to pause it and um, I'll bring you back in when we're there. Actually, it's the end of the episode almost. Right, I'll do a bit of driving and then in the next episode we'll... Um, yeah, saw this out. Um, whatever. <laughs> right, I'm just going to end the episode here. It's too much. So, thank you for watching, everyone. Really appreciate each and every view. And if you've liked this, please feel free to join me in the next one. So, in the next one, I'll be outside the cemetery and we'll start from there. So, cheers, everyone, and bye for now.